How's it going guys? My name is Leah Genocide and today I'm kind of taking a look at um, Avatar Honor and Duty, which it's an indie game on the Xbox Live. I kind of got into a way I'm going to start doing some more videos on these uh, just because I feel like they don't get looked at enough. Not always for bad reason, but um, you know, I know you know some of these videos have uh, been kind of popular on my channel in the past, so I'm going to do some. I don't really know if this is really going to be a look at or not. Um, now this is uh, it's a first person shooter, and you can tell by the name it's kind of a it's kind of a parody. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you the hard drive selection. <laughs> that should have happened already. Here's your options: graphics, brightness, you know, uh, music. Turn it down because it's not really good. I don't know what I was trying to say. Sorry. Um, controls. There they are. You can pause the screen if you want. Instructions. No, I'm not going to read them. Tell a friend, credits, exit. No, hold on. I just said I wasn't going to do that. Uh, there you go. That's that's who made the game. Now, I'm going to get into playing it. You can do explore the map. It's just one map. It's a little town. Uh, system link if you want. And play online. And okay, but before I jump into this, and well, I mean, as, as I'm joining the game, before you play this game, there's one thing you need to know, and it's that this game is terrible. I'll show you the machine gun because it's the funniest, but um, it, it's not good, or at least, okay, alright, so I died there, yeah, nothing wrong so far, right? Um, you know, not, not an instant respawn, but that's okay. Um, so, shot him somewhere, there's nothing telling me I was shooting anybody, except nothing. Um, okay. And now, looking, looking, here's who's in it. Okay, there's people. We knew that, though. All right, and right there. Now, the pistol, which he's got, pointless. Now, I didn't know what the uh, machine gun looked like, because the only time I've used it, it was uh, invisible. So, now you can taunt after you kill somebody. I'll show you one of these. It's, uh, oh, nope, I reload it instead, I guess. And there's Bane. Um, but there's nothing telling me what, sh like, that I'm hitting like anybody and uh, oh that's spawning by the way fantastic right uh, you go right through uh, enemies and now I'm dead <laughs> and uh, again the pistol's terrible I don't know why that guy's trying to use it so I just spawned right in front of that uh, that guy was right in front of me and him I'm gonna show you a taunt there's a taunt there's a taunt you get points for doing that you level up yeah it's, it's like Call of Duty or Battlefield or what have you Whatever your favorite uh, modern military shooter is, it's it's kind of similar to that, uh, except terrible, because uh, although it's not fun, or though people may not agree, and there's a radar because you know in case I couldn't find the people, which they're everywhere, turn a corner, and most likely they're there, and uh, there's that. Okay, I'm gonna do after I die, um, if that ever happens, ha ha ha. Um, I'm going. I'll show you a different weapon. All right, and he oh here's the grenade. Yeah. It's, uh, you know, you don't have a throwing arm. You're a soldier, not a baseball player, I guess. Alright, and there we go. Bane's, who's gonna die? Me or Bane? Hard to tell. Okay. The controls are, uh, awful. <laughs> like, awful. I can show you this. Respawn. SMG. Now, here we go. Again, spawning. It's, uh, completely random. But uh, as long as you're, you know, within eyesight of another player, you know, it's, it's you're, you're going to spawn. <laughs> There's Bane again. Now, I mean, these are real people. These aren't bots. So, you know, if you thought maybe that was a thing, then, you know, it's not. And the, I should, the carbine, I guess. And just so you know, um, I can't seem to activate my radar. I'm going to die because spawn, you know, why not? I don't know why that guy was in the ground. I don't know if he was dead or not. He just decided to go away. And out of ammo. Now, you can pick up ammo around the map, so I won't... I'll say that. That is a thing. I uh, couldn't use my radar. Don't know why. IDK. Uh, the carbine's terrible. And I haven't used a shotgun. And that was a grenade. Yeah, I cannot use my radar. So, Yeah. Can't use it. Don't know if I just I shouldn't be able to use it now or what. 
Now I'm, I'm going. Oh, there's a sprint button. I wouldn't recommend it because you uh, are already walking on, or running on frozen glass. Frozen glass. I don't know why it's frozen. Don't know why it's relevant, but it's it's frozen. It's slick. You don't understand. You get what I'm trying to say. And that reload was ridiculous. I'm gonna go ahead and respawn. Go up to shotgun again just because. So here it is. Not an insane amount of difference. Oh, here you go. Alright, so grenade's terrible. Oh, okay, shotgun. Shotgun might be the only good gun because it's not ridiculous. It'd be nice if, you know, the camera was good or the sensitivity or the aiming or the shooting or the anything. I mean, go ahead. You name something and it should be good. And that, But it's not. Now, what I don't understand is that uh, this is popular. People enjoy this, and I'm pretty sure. Um, and it'll sell well. Should it? No. No, it shouldn't. Why will it sell well? Because people are retarded and gullible. I don't know why. Like, the indie market's terrible. I guess they think it's only a dollar. But, see, the issue is that it plagues us. Because there are some good indie games on here for just a dollar. There's some great games on the indie marketplace that are extremely, extremely good. Uh, I made a game with zombies in it. Uh, the Dead Pixel is good. Um, trying to think, there's other things, but they're not coming to mind at this very, very second. Excuse me for not being able to think of something. But, um, yeah, I know there's plenty. I know there's plenty. There's just, like, obviously before Minecraft came out, there were some Minecraft clones that were decent. You know, they were decent for what they were. And they, and they were blatantly Minecraft clones. Um, although the only one I won't defend, and there you go, I came in second. So, that's all I'm going to show, because I'm not going to play this game anymore. It's awful. Uh, I spent a dollar on it, so you don't have to. So, if you're curious... This game's terrible. There are um, Call of Duty slash Battlefield, well, mostly Call of Duty clones on here that are decent. Not great, but decent. This is not one of them. Um, I'll go and try to find the ones that are good, but please stay away from this. Do not give them money. They don't deserve it. All right, so Strange Game Studios, you should be ashamed of yourself. This is terrible, and you are the problem with the Xbox indie market. I want to thank you guys for watching. Um, for watching, <laughs> I don't know what that was, but um, you know, leave a like if you liked it. Uh, comment if you have anything to say about anything. Subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you guys next time.